Gypsy King has returned! When is the Tyson going to be ready? Mm. Because Usyk is looking just you know, right now for unification. Alexander Usyk. The cat Alexander Usyk of Ukraine versus the Gypsy King Tyson Fury of England is a historic battle the most anticipated match after more than 20 years since Lennox Lewis. We are <laughs> this will be your chance to decide who will become a legend. Usyk is ready. Is Fury ready to face? Is the fight between these two super heavyweights possible? Or will the opportunity go to other heavyweights hungry for this opportunity? Like Deontay Wilder or Joe Joyce? All will be in today's video. But before jumping into the video, remember to like, subscribe, and tap the bell icon so you don't miss out on updates. We managed to get the Usyk uh, match and it was a pleasure working in this incredible stadium. Usyk manager and Sis Fury is still top priority. We're interested only in unification. Usyk and Fury once challenged each other for the most awaited unification match. То якось немає інтересу ні з ким більше боксувати. З ним поєдине хочеться, він буде дуже гучний. Ну, він же каже, що він король. Immediately after Usyk 2013 KOs defeated Anthony Joshua in August in their rematch in Jeddah, Saudi Arabia, he called out Fury to an undisputed fight, suggesting furthermore that he would consider retiring if he could not get that fight next. However, efforts to make the fight were unsuccessful because while Fury wanted to fight by the end of the year, Usyk insisted he would not be ready to fight again until next year. Fury then tried to pursue a fight with Joshua to fight in Cardiff, Wales on December 3rd, but those talks recently reached a dead end. Hey Tyson, back in ring, please. Back in ring. Meanwhile, Usyk also hinted at a memorable match against some other heavyweights. With Fury, 32 one 23 KOs, looking to other opponents, Usyk in the meantime has expressed interest in fighting the likes of Alabama's Wilder and England's Joyce, a sentiment reciprocated by both fighters. Joyce, who lost to Usyk in the amateurs, is now the top challenger for Usyk's WBO belt. Joe Joyce, 15-0, 14 KOs, is coming off a career-best win over Joseph Parker last month. Deontay Wilder returned to the ring for the first time since his TKO loss to Fury a year ago against Robert Hellenius on October 15th at the Barclays Center in Brooklyn, New York. However, Usyk's side recently confirmed that Fury is always the top priority. According to Aegis Klimas, the veteran manager of WBA, WBO and IBF unified heavyweight titleist Usyk, the plan is still to match his charge against WBC titleist Tyson Fury for a full unification showdown. Klimas, who also handles three-division Ukrainian champion Vasily Lumachenko, shot down any other possibilities for Usyk in the immediate future. There are so many reasons for this historic match to take place. Firstly, Usyk believes that the audience deserves to witness this legendary match. At least it is based on sportsmanship. Here's what Usyk told Ring Magazine, that he was not sad at all. The bigger problem is Tyson Fury is not letting fans see one of the best historical bouts in boxing history. That's his fault, not Usyk's. 
Tyson Fury can fight whoever he wants to fight, but from the standpoint of sportsmanship, of course, it's not correct. Secondly, this will be the biggest unification match since Lennox Lewis more than 20 years ago. Britain's Lennox Lewis was the last undisputed heavyweight champion after beating Evander Holyfield in 1999. Since 2007, the undisputed heavyweight championship has included the WBO title, and there has never been a fight where all four belts were on the line. And currently, three championship belts, WBA, WBO, and IBF, are in the hands of Ukrainian champion Oleksandr Yusik. The WBC championship belt is dominated by British champion Tyson Fury. Both are undefeated heavyweights, so finding a winner of all four titles is a must. Former champion Lewis has been talking about these exciting developments and he gave his predictions on an undisputed clash between the Gypsy King and Ukrainian hero Yusik. And Lewis is backing his fellow Brit to bring back the full set of titles. Third, Tyson Fury is being dubbed the Gypsy King, is holding the throne for the WBC title, and has never had a single defeat in his boxing career. Alexander Yusik is also an undefeated giant in heavyweight with three prestigious championship belts. Not to mention he also holds the number one spot in the cruiserweight rankings. There's too much controversial debate about the ratings of the two boxers. Fury fans naturally think he's at the top, and Yusik fans think the cat is the best. So the war between them will be the answer to all. Will this match still take place? Until now, Tyson Fury hasn't responded to what Yusik said, but we can expect the usual fireworks from him. The big man never misses a chance to come up with some creative counter that will most likely make headlines in the boxing community. For now, he's getting ready to fight any opponent this year or next year. Remember, Fury promoter Frank Warren also wanted this fight to happen and insisted it would. So, if Usyk still ranks Fury as the top of the potential opponents, then this battle will probably let boxing fancy an explosive fight between the two heavyweight kings next year. Wilder, Joe Joyce and other heavyweights have to wait longer. Deontay Wilder, Joe Joyce, and the crop of other top heavyweight contenders eager to put their hands on southpaw ace Oleksandr Yusik may have to wait longer than they would like before they get their chance, if the Ukrainian champion's handler has anything to say about the matter. So, do you think this historic title unification match can take place? And who will win all the championship belts and become a legend in heavyweight boxing? Please leave your comments below to let us know. Don't forget to like, subscribe and tap the bell icon so you don't miss any video from Boxing One. Stay safe and we'll see you next time.